Look at this. Look at all the people that go there like every year. And me not getting to be one of them again. Ah. It's pretty. Like, look at it. You guys could see it. It's on my feed. <clears throat> That's insane. It must have been nice. The problem for me is I can only go to one concert every year because it's out of my way. Like, I have to, it's two hours to go, two hours to come back, right? By the time I come, if the concert ends late at night, by the time I come back, it's the next day. And then I always have fucking problems here because they're, they're like, why are you out so fucking late? I'm like, I'm not doing anything wrong. I'm just enjoying nightlife and the music, okay? <clears throat> okay, then Jack revamped the website for the coffee. You guys saw this, right? I left this year. Yeah, Jack did coffee. And then Christine, I like that, like, I was anticipating... Because April 1st, everybody, like, all, like, the, the, the YouTube creators, like, their businesses, they always drop, like, fun April Fool's Day items, right? Um, so I was anticipating this from Jack because the year before, I think we had the, the soap and then we had the, the, the candle, right? I missed out on both because I didn't know they were real. That kid, the, the soap would have been fucking perfect. I, like, I didn't know it was real. We should have tried that. So I was waiting this year to see what he was going to do again, right? Um... <clears throat> okay, so I'll get back to that. So then, um, Christine decided to drop, um, we decided to drop a hummus collection on April Fool's Day. Again, I thought this wasn't real, but it was real. It looks really close to the, the barista collection. But anyways, I'm pretty sure it's all sold out now, but look, that, that's the, the one that dropped. Um... I like garlic glitter is a is a brilliant name for a shade. I really like this. <clears throat> yeah, okay. Nothing else happened after that. I just talked about okay so i just scrolled down he dyed his hair already look see um uh, i just talked about this Okay, there's nothing really going on right now, which is great for me because that means I get a break. To be honest, I feel really tired. I want to go take a nap, but I know I need to finish filming this. Anyhow. Okay, back to Jack. I hope Jack's watching now. I know Jack's listening now. Like, oh my good god. You guys, oh, you guys are so much fun. <clears throat> Anyways, yeah, so April Fool's comes around. I made Jack the thumbnail of the playlist because I, I was waiting for his video to drop. I was like, I was like, I was online. I was like, there's nothing there. I was like, oh my God, am I wrong? Is there not going to be? And then there was a video and I was like, yes. Okay. <clears throat> so you revamped the, 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 the coffee site. See, like I have, okay, I have beef here with, with, with Jack, Jeffrey and Christine here because their websites aren't easy to navigate, right? Like, like, there's, there's certain things, like, when I use you guys' websites, I want to tweak it a little bit. <laughs> it's so irritating. Anyhow, yeah, so he re he revamped his website. I don't know if it's too childish looking now. Like, if, you're, if your target market is adults, and they're going to purchase coffee, and all the coffee looks very childish, like, I don't know what you're doing there. <laughs> It's cute, though. I don't know if, like, maybe I'll get tones hooked on it. I don't know. But anyways, so for April Fool's, he, instead of doing... So he did the candle, he did the soap, which I wish I didn't fucking miss out on. This year, he decided to drop the... The the the, 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 the mug. Oh, my God, look. Okay, we'll get back to this. When I'm going through the playlist, we're going to get back to this. Or should I say this now? Let's go through this now. <clears throat>
he drops an ASMR video. It was already weird. I was like, what is happening? <laughs> See, let's, let's skip a little bit. Did you guys watch this video? If you didn't, go watch it. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, look, you guys watch this. Oh my god, it cut- he's talking about coffee and it cut to Dairy Queen. <laughs> oh my god. And Ikea. Okay, thanks Ikea. Back to- back to Jack. <sighs> On the website you said, here's a potato for scale. <laughs> when I saw this, I was like, oh my god, I didn't think it, like, in my life I'd ever see a Jacksepticeye guy fisting a coffee cup online. Oh my dear god. <laughs> this made my day to see. 32 ounces is a lot. Yeah, oh yeah, I complained about this because dad doesn't like when we have to go keep- he doesn't like having us to refill the fucking cup. <clears throat> So this is dad size. This is a full fucking 32 ounces of a liter. Okay. Okay. Two things I wanted to say here. Mega Muff has a good ring to it. But anyways, two things I wanted to say here. Oh, look at it. I fucked up because I knew I was forgetting something. This this mug alone costs fifty dollars. Okay. <clears throat> the food I ordered today cost me $55 and it lasts us two days, okay? So now looking at this mug, I'm like, I'm debating. Do I want to eat for two days or do I need a, a cup a, a cup to drink coffee in a, a cup that I'm not going to use, right? <laughs> $50 is a lot of fucking money. And then I realized I fucked up here because I forgot to say... sets okay who in their right mind is gonna buy one fucking cup one mug one mega fucking mug for fifty dollars like there's no bundle there's no like set price right there's like you know like you ones for 50 or like you get two for like i don't know 45 or something there's no like Jack, man, do you not know how to run a business? <laughs> ah! He's legitly in the video, too. He's holding two. He's holding two up into, like, like, oh, my God. So that's the only reason why I didn't put my order in. Who's gonna go all the way for one cup? Suppose it's $50 and it breaks, and I don't have a replacement one. This should have been, you should have done sets. Like, you could get one, you can get two. You can get four. You know, like how glasses and things get sold. <clears throat> and then... I told you make the... Like, he made... I said make the mugs cute. Like, all these, like, cups and things. Make them cute. He ended up making the website cute. This needs to be cuter. You know what I mean? Like... Ah. Uh... Anyways, I saw that and I got happy. But, like, I have... that. Those are my notes. <laughs> Oh. I thought it was hilarious. Okay, when I started watching Jack's videos, 
<clears throat> was during the green hair e green hair era, right? Same thing. So now you guys' energy is all similar. That's why I'm talking about it like this. Because when I when I watched Jeffrey's videos, he was with Nathan. When I watched your videos, you were you had the green hair, right? Um. <clears throat> At the time, it's usually Bri watching all these gaming channels, right? So at the time, he used to watch you, Felix, and Mark, right? And he doesn't watch your content anymore, but me, to me and Tones watch your stuff all the time, right? Um... meme time, reading your comments all the way, funniest videos, we watch all of those things, right? I don't watch you play games, <laughs> which is probably what your channel is, no, I lie, I do, I watched when you did the Goose series, I know you did other series, but I didn't watch that, <laughs> uh, like, when you did God of War, I know you did that series, but I didn't watch through it, right? Anyhow. <clears throat> so, every time we put on your channel now, Bri doesn't like watching it because he's, like, he only, like, watching your, your channel for one type of content. Um, but I don't care. I'll watch whatever you you drop because you, you, your energy is so hilarious. I know, like... I can't draw on you guys' energy because you guys are going through similar stuff like like me, right? Like, you feel pain, but you can't, you're not allowed to show it, right? So if I had to draw energy from you, I still feel that pain coming back, right? Um, a lot of people said the creative side of YouTube is dead, right? And that's only because finances are involved now right <clears throat> you have to find a compromise between because back in the day they used to post for fun right like you would just post fun game videos and then you don't care how well they did but now you're dependent on how well they do now to like right because it's work now so now you have to find that happy in between and most people are selling their souls to like upload content that doesn't make them happy right <clears throat> it doesn't make them happy it's not fulfilling to them but it is for their audience right so like i'm comparing it to like i'm using bri as an example right suppose like he only likes watching your i don't know like happy reels videos and you only upload those because you know they're gonna do well but they don't make you feel fulfilled whereas <clears throat> you have people like me right I'll watch any because i like watching people's ups and downs right i like watching their journey and how they like getting through life um, I'll watch anything as long as it's hilarious, right? Like, I don't like those, like, rambly type videos or, like, you know what I mean? Like, because you guys' energy is fun and lighthearted. Like, just watching this ASMR, like, it was so cringe, but watching it, it made my day, you know what I mean? <clears throat> Even though it was probably, like, the worst promotion video for that mug ever. <laughs> um... Anyways, my point here after, okay, so first off, make the mugs cuter, make sets, because that's not how you sell glassware. <laughs> Third off, when you're doing videos and you feel like you, you're burnt out, this is the, my point. If you're feeling burnt out and everything feels like, because the creative side is gone now, right? It's just like the, the business side of the videos. Um, you can still put those videos out, but if you have enough energy left over, you should do, like, pa like passion projects, right? Do something that you feel a spark doing, you know what I mean? And that doesn't just go for you, it goes for, like, whoever else is listening, right? Like, you could be... I'm just using you as an example here, but, like, I can feel that here. <clears throat> That's what I'm telling you. 
Okay, anyways, yeah, I think I said my piece there. Thank you for the, 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 the April Fool's surprise that made my day. I wasn't expecting that at all. I was expecting, like, some... Some next weird concoction between, like, candle and soap. Oh my god, the soap would have been great to bring back. I want to try that. It looks so sick. <coughs> Anyhow. We were busy that day, too. I don't remember what I was doing. And Brian wouldn't let me watch the fucking video because when you dropped that video, you were in the tub naked, right? He wasn't going to let me watch it anyways. Of course I was going to fucking miss it. Damn it. Okay, I think I said my piece here. Thanks, Sean. <laughs> that made my day. Thank you. Anyhow. If you guys want pointers on what I would tell you to improve your websites, get back to me on that because I need to, like, I can't tell you off the top of my head. I haven't been on them in a while. Like, the... The aesthetics is there. You guys, like, the aesthetics is all there. It's just that the, 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 the navigating through the website's so fucking annoying. I'm pretty sure for Christine's, it's, like, the conversion. For Jack, it's, like... No, not Jack, sorry. It's for Jeffrey, it's, um... Something, there's, like, a glitch with the search. Or, like, something on the, on the, on the navigation bar there. There's a problem. And then on your website now, Jack... Um... I know on Cloak's website, because this pisses me off, right? It's irritating. Christine knows this is a problem, too. Um, you guys have the... You guys keep the items that get sold out on the site, and it's so irritating when you know you can't go back and purchase that, right? Um... Oh, for the, because I looked at the new site, I saw you put up a few new items. But I'm still waiting on really, really cute mugs. I'm not a coffee drinker. I told you, like, if I drink coffee, it's going to make me want to sleep, so I can't drink coffee. And I know you're going to say there's tea and hot chocolate and shit there, but, like, I don't like chocolate either. And then, I don't drink tea yet, so I don't know. You gotta, <laughs> the only way you're going to get someone like me on this market here is through the mugs, okay? Because I like drink a hell ton, so if the the cups are cute, okay. <clears throat> it got dark really fast, holy shit. <laughs> Anyhow, okay, I said my piece there. I think. Yeah, if you guys want a more in-depth thing on the website, like I'll go through it. <laughs> Cause they're fucking irritating. On 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 desktop versus like on my phone is two different things. Aesthetics wise, you guys are all fine, but everything else, like the actual, like, little, little tweaks there, here and there, right? Anyways, it's 7.30 now. <clears throat> it's still raining. It's been raining nonstop all day. It's been raining since, like, 3 in the morning this morning, and it's, like, 7 now. Anyhow. Now it's the next matter of business, because we're going to be talking nonstop. <clears throat> okay what are we doing now i'm gonna move on to only one of then i'll do then i'll do ian then i'll do playlist so we'll, we'll, i'll go through youtube and then we'll see where we go from there okay <clears throat> okay let's tackle only one of now Okay, so, from my phone, I can't see, like, if there's concerts happening. I can't see it there, right? But on, on my desktop, again, we're going back to this website navigation bullshit. On my desktop now, when I'm on my computer, I can see the links for concerts, right? So, I'm watching, I put in the playlist. One of the only one of videos I, I watched, I put in the playlist, right? And I, for some reason, I decided to watch it on my computer. <clears throat> then I looked down and was like, wait, they're touring. There's concert tickets here. What is going on here? I click on this. It takes me to Ticketmaster. 
and I looked to see if, if they're coming here, right? Because I was like, there's no promotion. When you're on their, their channel, there's no promotion there that they're coming here, right? And then I see this. It says only one of is coming here. Only one of is coming here April 27th at 8. At this art center. And I was like, how come I didn't know? It's on a Thursday. How come I didn't fucking know about this? So then... <clears throat> I take the cards and I go and because I can only again I can only go to if I have to go to one card concert the whole year I make sure I pick a good one. So I see this and I was like, oh my god, only one of us here. I want to go see them. So I go and I read cards because I always do that before I order any type of tickets. If I have to go somewhere like far, this is like a spirit concern thing. So like I have to I have to read before I order tickets like this, right? So I go and I. I f okay, so it's April. Okay, it's April fifth right now. They're coming here April twenty seventh. I find about find out about this like last month, right? Um, so I do the reading. When I okay, so when I went to the the BTS concert, their reading was like sh a little shaky, right? And when I I read for Ian like the DPR's concert, everything was everything was like green lights and ready to go. So I know I had to go to that. So this one now, when I read. <laughs> I didn't have to read for ATs because I know I wasn't going to make it in time. I, if I had to go to one that whole year, I was going to go to Ian's, right? So now when I'm reading... Um, reading the energy for this concert, this upcoming concert coming up in like a couple of weeks from now, right? <clears throat> you go from shaky to like yes to like dead no. The cards are being, they're telling me I'm not allowed to go. And I'm looking at this like, is this why I didn't know about this till now? Why am I not allowed to go? <clears throat> Speaking of which, if TXT, well, TXT's going, they have their tour going on. I hope they come here. If TXT, AT, okay, if ATs comes back or TXT or Stray Kids come here, I'll definitely drop everything to go see you guys because it's so much fun. Twice is coming too. Speaking of which, oh my god, okay, so... Twice's new light stick is so pretty, you guys. I hope you like. There's. Oh my god. I hope. Ah. Uh, when I cut my hair and I come back sh look, with short hair, I think I'll do a light stick video because I really want that light stick, you guys. They're come. Twice are gonna be here too. I don't know when, but I know they're touring and they're coming here too. And I'm not gonna get to see them. But oh my god, I want the light stick. It's so pretty. Anyhow, back to the story. Yeah, so I, re I read the, the reading says I can't go. Right? Speaking of which, hold on, let me let me tap on this for a second. By the time I find out about this, most of like the the seats are taken, right? It's like a theater, right? So there's actual I think there's physical seats, right? I can't believe they can't. they're coming here. The, the 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 capacity of that place is about five hundred or so, six hundred people, right? So it's gonna be an even smaller venue than when I went to the DPR one, and I was like, oh my god, like I really like I that's why I read. I was like, I want to go and like I'm gonna be close up enough to see them, but not have them look at me. You know what I mean? Like I'm gonna get some really good footage if I go like this. But anyhow, all by the time I looked at this, like all the seats are gone. And they're expensive now too. They're in like the hundred dollar range. And I've never been to this place. And then on top of that, the reading told me not to go. Right? Look at it. There's the map. There's the prices. It, ideally, so the stage is here. Ideally, if I was going to go to this, I'd sit somewhere like in an aisle seat, right? So I'm on an angle, but I'm not blocking anyone because I'm going to be, f I want, I want to, oh my God, it would have been a good, oh, <laughs> it would have been great to get more concert footage, guys. Anyhow, so all of those ideal seats are already gone. 
Um, anyhow. <clears throat> I did the reading and it told me I couldn't go. So then first thing I did was I looked at seats. So I'm never, I'm never going to get a proper seat. Prices are too high, right? Because I missed it. I don't know when the tickets went on sale. They went on sale and I fucking missed it. And it's so short no notice that I don't have anything to wear even if I did want to go, right? Then they chose to come in April. And I don't feel like moving. I don't like moving around in the spring. And then... The night that concert's supposed to happen is supposed to be the night of the first quarter moon. I told you I like last quarter. So it's going to be during a first quarter moon. And then... I looked at the map to see the location of this place, right? And it's right next to... It's close by to the cemetery. And I was like, this is why the spirits aren't going to let me go. Because if I go there, I'm going to bring something back with me. I was like, fuck no. Yeah, so I can't go. I can't go because the venue is so close to a cemetery. And it's late at night and it's on a first quarter moon. I can't go. And even if I could go, I don't have anything to wear. And tickets are too expensive. That's so upsetting, but if I did go and filmed because you know how like everybody does their own fan cams i'm not gonna go record all of them i don't when i went to the bts one i didn't know how it was gonna go and i didn't want to kill my battery that time and i didn't have this new phone so i didn't want i didn't i took pictures but i didn't record anything well i recorded like stuff here and there but i didn't record like a full-length song right then when i went to the dpr one I recorded everything. I wasn't going to miss a single thing. I didn't care if my phone died. I wanted every single moment, every single second of that, okay? Because now, like, in a situation like this where I'm feeling like shit, I can go back and watch that to feel a little bit better. <clears throat> and I only had to focus on Ian, right? I had to focus on Ian and live, but, like, I didn't have to switch between so many members. You know what I mean? So now looking at this now, looking at only one of now, if I go to record them now, like we're, now we're in like an ideal setting. But there's no way I'm going to record all of them at once. I told you guys like Junji's my bias, right? So I would want to like focus on Junji. But like the way his energy is not going to come through on camera and Nine's energy would. So if I had to go, I would film Nine. Because his fan cams would be fun. His energy reads through right like you could feel it through the screen right if i had to if i had to film them but then reading their energy now both of them would probably tell me do kv's fan cams right i don't know why like <laughs> so we can all fan together we can all just enjoy kv's fan cams right um so if i went i have that dilemma now right i'm like i like junji them two would probably tell me to both to film kb but Nine's energy reads through the most, so I would probably film Nine. <clears throat> yeah, so I have that problem now. It's like, who do I fucking focus on if I have to go? <laughs> uh... Yeah, problems on top of problems. <laughs> I'm cheering for you guys, even though I can't be there. I just can't believe, like, they're here, right? Like, ah! <laughs> That's so exciting! It's so, so exciting. And I can't go. That's such a sad thing. I'm gonna have to watch the, the concert, like, because everybody f films everything. I'll probably end up watching the, the concert later. 
I watched the one from the 80s one that I missed out on. And I was like, oh, man. timing was wrong they took they chose the start of december and then these guys are coming in a couple weeks from now but they still chose a bad time damn it why would you pick rainy season you guys gotta pick look at the weather properly if you're gonna come here come during like autumn time when it's wet sweater sweater weather god that's another like tongue twisting thing to say <laughs> Anyhow, that's my rant on that now. It's just so exciting. I found out about them. Like, finally, some good news. It was like, uh, there's a group I like that's coming here, and I can't go and see them. Oh, my God. And I have to watch the... Watch the... I don't even know if anybody, because it's, like, it's a smaller venue. If anyone's going to record this. I was like, someone please record this so I can see. I want to watch. <clears throat> Anyhow. That happened. Jesus, we've been talking about so much shit today. We talked about... The nightmare I had this morning. All about the glass. What did I talk about after that? I don't remember. See, like, I can't even remember when I said this this morning. Okay, I talked about, I, I talked to Jeffrey when I came back just now. And then I talked to Jack. And then talked about only one of. Anything else I'm missing? We did my hair this morning. <laughs> Am I missing anything else? Okay, anyways. Po main reason I'm here to film this, aside from all those other important things. <clears throat> okay, I gotta talk to Ian now. <sighs> I feel like the, the, the that fluttery feeling, because I was like, oh my god, I feel shaky to like talk now. <clears throat> okay, so I messaged Ian and I told him... Okay, I don't know if this is my fault. So enlighten me, please. Uh, I had that realization that I liked him in the last video, right? I don't know if that came off as a really messed up confession. But, uh, like, his energy suddenly went really... He dipped, right? <clears throat> so, like, now I need to... Like, I don't know if that was my fault. If it was my fault, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Oh, dear God. 